The 38th International Eel Pound Festival is coming up next week in Walker. It brings out more than 12,000 people, and plenty will be kissing one of the ugliest bottom-dwelling catches out there. That's not a nice thing to say about your friends. It's <laughs> one of the Eel Pound organizers, Jared Olson, joins us now. Jared, great to have you with us. Thank you, guys. You did bring a, an eel. I did bring an eel pout. All right. We'll, we'll get, get to, to that the eel in, a second. in a minute. We'll, we'll bring Austin out in a bit. Oh, that's Austin, great. He's yeah, got a name. Yeah. All right, good to know who you're kissing. Uh, all right, so let's talk about first uh, the warm weather. Weather. I mean, yeah. this has been a crazy stretch. How is that going to affect the festival? Yeah, so I think you guys are going to have, what, 61 here Monday, and yeah, we'll be right. up to 47, uh, which is That's very, very, yeah, warm. very high for yeah. us. Uh, we still have some freezing temperatures at night, so we are going to monitor the edges because those usually go out first. Uh, but we did call driving restrictions this year again. Uh, so basically, people can bring their fish houses up, set them up on the lake, and then they all have to have their trucks off by Friday at noon. Uh, that, that'll get half of the weight off of the bay, sure. park them in town, uh, and then they can pick them up on uh, on Sunday. And you've done this before, so yeah, yeah. It, it, unfortunately, it, we've had this weather. Situation. Yeah, it's you know it happens, and when it does, you know people still have their four wheelers and rangers; they yeah, can still get around. No uh, but you know, safety is the number one concern. All right, so so what goes on out at the Eel Pound Festival apart from you know kiss, kissing the eel? Pound? Well, the big thing is that we have a fishing tournament, obviously, which is you know catching the eel pout. Um, the biggest one last year was about 12, 13 pounds that wow, was caught. That's a big fish. Yeah, that's a big fish. Yeah, and they went that that guy won I think about fifteen hundred dollars in different wow. prizes. Yeah, cool. so um, a lot of fish come in. The top ten heaviest fish, um, you know, win prizes. We also have the polar pout plunge, uh, where people jump in the ice. This is the time to yeah, do it. Yeah. Oh, it's yeah. I mean, they're probably going to be wearing you know sunscreen jumping <laughs> in this year. It'll still be plenty cold. Oh yeah, though, yeah, 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 right, right. Yeah. So, but that raised uh, thirty-eight thousand for our local community center last year. Fantastic. Yeah. So those are Fantastic. two of my favorite events. But there's mechanical bull riding. Uh, beer pong tournament, yeah, uh, the bikini stuff. show, as, the bikini as you show. had Point alluded to Matt earlier. brought that up. Matt brought it up. <laughs> That's fine. Well, that seems like the logical point to transition into sure. a discussion of yeah. kissing the eel pound. Right. How did that? How did that all start? Um, you know, people. I think people have been kissing fish for a long time. I mean, just as, as you catch, you catch uh, that fish. You, you catch kiss a big it. one, and out of respect, you know, you give it a kiss, and that's you right. say, "I'll catch you later." That's, uh, I mean, that's all it, kisses are it, done out of respect. It, I believe. Oh, and yeah. once you see this thing, I mean, you're just going to want to kiss all right, it. Let's but get I, out. I'm sure that's how it came up. So, so who this, do we have here? This is Austin, and I always this name Austin. him. I name him after whoever caught it. Um, okay, so oh Austin boy. caught this guy. Yep. Let's see if he right, wants to be picked up here. This is very dramatic, the reveal here. He, he, uh, he's he's, and he, this is, you said this is a relatively small right, pound. Right, so this. We're still talking three, four pounds? Yeah, and so the biggest record was just caught on Lake of the Woods, and it was just pushing 20. So this okay. is about three to four. So and where do you recommend kissing? The, I like I like the nose. I mean, then yeah, you can do the yeah, eye contact. Right on the nose, you have you a know, moment. Yeah, right. do you want to have the moment? Okay, hang on there. We want to, uh, all right. We got to right get on. this. Mm. Oh, yeah. Wow. Come on now. Yeah. You got the that was coolest, great. You have the coolest job. Matt's you, gonna pass. I can, do, I can do weather. Did you ever think this morning pass? when you woke up that you'd be Matt would kiss the eel pout, but now he's worried that it's he, good luck for life, buddy. All right. He's Come the on. second to kiss it. Oh. There you go. Boy, oh, that was more on. sensual than I was prepared for. That, I think that's very nice. Really <laughs> soft lips. Soft on the eel lips. Soft lips. A little cool. Wow. A little cool to the touch, but you know what? Takes all sorts. 2017 the International Eel yep. Pout Festival is next Thursday through Friday, February 23rd to 26th. <laughs> go to cco.com slash links for more information. Could I just have one more? Just maybe. You want to go back for seconds? Oh, wow. yeah. It's a moisturizer. It really is. <laughs> I don't need a second. I'm good. Jared, thank okay. you so much. Thank you, guys. <laughs>